an investigation is underway after Go Transit special constables used pepper spray during an arrest outside Union Station. The incident was partially caught on camera by a passerby who says he was shocked by the use of force. And it's raising questions about what authority special constables have when it comes to incidents off of TTC property. You have no legal grounds to hold. Okay, ready to go? You ready I want to go? my Got your stuff. When I turned around and, and kind of looked, they were crossing the street over to the west side of York Street. And um, when they got to the other side, they pepper sprayed the gentleman on that side of the street, which uh, was kind of like surprising and shocking to me. That's what Amar Walla says prompted him to pull out his phone and start filming Monday night. Seeing a man surrounded by four special constables and pepper sprayed while across the street from Union Station. The escalation was the part that shocked me and how far away from TTC property they were is what shocked me. So as a Torontonian, I really would like to know very clearly what is the authority that GO officers have in that situation. The pepper spray wasn't caught on camera, but the moments after were. The special constables are seen talking to a second man when one of them notices while a filming. Sir, who are you? You need some help? Stand back right your phone might be uh, no, Walla is initially allowed to continue, but he goes on to question the constables about their authority. Then he instructs the man not to give up his ID. You have a piece of ID, anything with your name on it? You don't have to show my ID. Don't show. You want some? You want some? Can you just back away, please? You're intervening with my investigation. Why are you touching? You're gonna get arrested. Why are you? And at that point, one of them kind of grabbed me by the arm and, and kind of moved me out of the way and told me that I would be ex uh, arrested for obstruction and my phone kind of clicked off at that point. Wallace says he filed a complaint with GO Transit after the incident, questioning the use of force by the special constables and the fact that they exerted their powers outside Union Station on a public sidewalk. During the uh, resistive arrest, sometimes you have to, in order to protect them physically, protect their cells, protect the public you have to keep people away you have to ensure ensure that you can subdue the person safely metrolink spokesperson Anne marie aiken confirms pepper spray was deployed during last night's incident which she says began inside the station long before wallace started rolling she explains special constables are designated under provincial legislation and that gives them certain powers they can arrest people they can charge people they can um, uh, they, they carry certain tools with them they don't don't carry guns, but they carry batons, they carry um, uh, handcuffs and uh, pepper spray. The incident is being investigated, as is always the case, anytime there's an instance of use of force. Metrolinx is also investigating Wallace's complaint. Akins says special constables are within their right to ask suspects and witnesses for their ID. And she says their authority does extend beyond TTC and go transit property. If they are on duty and they are in between stations, they have a, a, a right and an obligation to uh, and do whatever they can to keep the peace. If you can imagine it, if we lost our jurisdiction, all you have to do is go outside of a station and and then you're home free. Uh, you're home free, and officers would have no powers whatsoever. So if you can see the importance of not uh, not losing that. The Metrolinx says the man that special constables arrested was handed over to Toronto police and they tell us he was transported to hospital. It doesn't appear that any charges were laid.